Hello dear friends, welcome to my channel Debs Coding Hub. Recently, I have started a series on number system and this is the third video of this series. This video covers binary to hexadecimal conversion. This video is intended for absolute beginners. This is a very small video but thoroughly explained. So watch the video till the end. The first thing we need to learn in binary to hexadecimal conversion is a table. Let us find binary equivalent of 16 hexadecimal digits starting from 0 to 15. Now let us see the table. As you can see, the binaries of hexadecimal 0 to f is shown in the table and the highest digit of hexadecimal which is f is occupying 4 binary places. So let us summarize our observation. The highest hexadecimal digit, which is 15, represented by F, needs only 4 binary places to represent it. So to convert binary to hexadecimal, we need to mark group of 4 digits from right to left and convert each binary group to a decimal equivalent to find the hexadecimal numbers. As we have seen, that a hexadecimal digit must occupy four binary digits so we'll fill this leading blank spaces which is there for the digit 0 to 7 with 0 so 0 will be 0000, 0, 0, 0 in binary 1 will be 0, 0, 0, 1 in binary and so on. Now let us convert from binary to hexadecimal. So convert 100, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1 to hexadecimal. What is the number? The number is 100101. 0, 0, 1, 0, 1. So let us mark this number into two groups of four binary digits from right to left. So the first group is 0, 1, 0, 1 and the second group we have only one, two, two digits. So leading digits may be 0 or it may be left alone. So we will get two hexadecimal digit for this binary equivalent. So it will be a two hexadecimal digit number. So the first digit is 0101. So this is a binary number. And we have marked all this with their position 0123. So let us move to the second digit. The second digit will be calculated from the binary 10 and we have also marked this as 0, 1, 2, 3 this leading bit may be 0 so to calculate the first digit we will convert this binary into decimal equivalent or hexadecimal equivalent so it is 1 into 2 to the power 2 as because position 2 is holding 1 and again, position 0 is holding 1 and it is plus 1 into 2 to the power 0. And it will be 5 after calculation. So the first digit I have calculated is 5. It will be in the unit place. And let us calculate the next one. 
it will be calculated as 1 into 2 to the power the position which is 1 and it will be calculated as 2 so a hexadecimal of 100101 is 25 Now let us move to the quicker method where we will calculate hexadecimal equivalent of a binary very quickly. Let us take the same number 100101. Let us mark this in two groups of four binary digits if available. And let us split this in two digits. So let us recall the table we have created in the previous slide. Now, if I compare this 101 or 0101, I'll find it here in the table and it is equivalent to 5. So I can directly write the digit as 5. Similarly, for this one, 10 zero will be 0010 zero and I can find it here. And I can see the hexadecimal equivalent is 2. So I can directly write this number as 2. So this is how we can quickly calculate hexadecimal equivalent of a binary number. So hexadecimal of 100, 101 is 25. So this is the quicker method. For this you have to learn this table. Let us try few more examples. Let us now convert 100101000 to hexadecimal. Now this could be split into two groups of four binary digits. And they are directly converted as 4 and 9 as because if you remember the table 0 1 0 0 is 4 and 1 0 0 1 is 9 so the hexadecimal equivalent of 1 0 0 1 0 1 0 0 will be 94 let us see one more example in this example, we will be converting 11110101 to hexadecimal. So let us again make the groups. There are two groups. The first digit will be 0101. And in this case, 0101 will be the first digit. And 1111 will be the second digit. 0101 is 5. And 111 is 15, and 15 is represented by F. So the number will be F5. So the hexadecimal of 11110101 is F5. That's all for today. If you don't know how to convert binary to decimal or decimal to binary, you can see my older videos. The link will be given in the description.